Hello, Wild Detective. The story I'm about to tell you I have read in the tracks and signs of Senior Tracker and Senior Evaluator for Cyber Tracker Program, Casey McForlan. His pictures have been taken from the valley side where Casey lives in northern Utah up to the mountainside. Your challenge is to try to ID who the narrator can be before the story unravels. So put on your tweed hat, Sherlock, and adjust your loincloth, Mowgli. Are you ready? Once upon a track, I was grazing delicious aquatic grass in the river valley. As I pulled my head out of the water to look for Mummy, I found myself alone. Where has she gone? Mummy! Okay, keep calm. Nose in the wind. Follow the smell. Hmm, I got her. Galloping to close the gap, I proudly ran past her. Not even did I manage to find her, but I also knew where she was heading. The ridge line. So I opened the way, cutting straight on the vertical slopes. Nearly to the top. A last effort. There we are. What a view. I lie down to catch my breath and wait for her. What an effort. Snow is cooling down my boiling muscles. I love it. She's still far behind. And I'm feeling drowsy now. I'll take a quick nap. Hey, there she comes. But, Mom, I'm here. I'm here. Wait for me. Sulking? Okay, I'll stay by your side now. Let's walk the crest together. Right. Have you found from which animal's perspective the story has been told? You need to rewind to make up your mind? Or are you ready for the revelation? Three, two, one. All right, it's a moose calf following his mother. So did you get it right? Bravo, you can now live happily ever after. Or at least until our next story. If you don't want to miss it, subscribe, click on the bell, thumbs up, Share and tip. Happy tracks.